we are so afraid of what people think that when our kid starts to yell and make noise, we're hushing them up. We're so quick to hush them up or we're so quick to throw food at them. Here, here, baby, here, eat your, you know, whole grain wheat organic Cheerios. Well, first of all, the kid doesn't want whole grain wheat organic Cheerios. That's probably why he was, you know, even crying to begin with because he's got, you know, a bad fiber issue and he pooped in his diaper and the stuff tastes like crap. Who knows what, right? But, you know, parents are throwing food at their child when they start to throw a fit. What you need to do when your two-year-old starts to throw a fit is just take them out of the restaurant, take them out of the store, bring them into the car and let him scream his head off. All right. Now, yeah, you know, I would put the air conditioning on in the car. I would either sit in the car or if I couldn't listen to it anymore, I'd get out of the car, but let the kids scream. It's not going to hurt the kid. They aren't going to dehydrate. And if they do dehydrate, you could always go Go to your doctor and put in IV fluids. But I mean, think about it. Why are we always trying to hush our kids up when they have a temper tantrum? Let them get it out. I mean, in the olden days, you know, we didn't have to pent up all our frustrations. Remember in the olden days, we used to be able to chop down a cherry tree. You know, we used to throw plates. You know, I remember watching TV shows in the 70s. The wives always threw plates. And remember the husband would have to run and hide. And and as that swing door, I think it even happened on I Love Lucy, that swing kitchen door closed, the plate would hit the door. You know how much better we would feel if we got to throw plates? Now, that wouldn't work in my household because we have a bunch of those plastic plates. I mean, we're a very clumsy family. So we, I I get all those kind of plastic target plates you could get for a buck or two. And that's what I feed them on. Except of course, when, you know, fancy friends come over, then I, you know, pull out the fancy China. We have fancy friends and unfancy friends, by the way, if any of my friends are listening, I do group you guys. I'm sorry. And you all probably know who you are if you're on the unfancy group because you guys get the paper plates, right? But my fancy friends, I mean, we break out the china. So we don't really have plates to throw. But if you think about it, we were really able to pent, to, to vent out our frustrations. So what makes you think a two year old wants to be shut up? All right. Throw the two-year-old in the car or bring him out. Let him stand on the sidewalk out, out in front of Walmart and scream. You know what, what? And then he'll stop. And when he stops, you go, are you done? All right. And if you are done, then good. Then bring him back in. But none of this hushing, hushing them up. I, it, you know, it's ridiculous.